not staying here not staying here yep staying here <laughs> guess where oh my god I'm like so excited I could like literally yeah I think I like okay so oh my god I'm like freaking out I have always wanted to do this oh my gosh can you guess which room we're having tonight oh my god oh my god oh my god I'm not even trying to be over dramatic some people's dreams are to stay at Grand Floridian not me that's not my dream <laughs> mine is a little bit more it's a little bit more black and white now this this was my dream I have always 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 since the day this opened wanted to stay in the Dalmatian rooms and I never have I think because it just never worked out you know but today Disney I'd like to thank you this is the most adorable cutest themed area in the entire world for someone like me that's obsessed with Dalmatians I have always since the day I could speak words love Dalmatians love them love them I mean obsessed with the everything Dalmatian Even my parents, they're like, all she would do is just watch 101 Dalmatians on repeat over and over. And I would ask my parents, can I please get a Dalmatian? No, when you're older. So I did that. Look at the little canine crunchies. You have no idea how badly I wish Gracie could be here right now. Gracie? Is that... I should know better about squirrels. That hurt, by the way, when that squirrel bit me here. And everyone that knows me knows that this was always my thing. My screen name on AIM was I got a Dalmatian. Not gonna tell you the numbers. And I've been using Dalmatians as my passwords for like not anymore. So don't even try. But <sighs> yep, love them. I don't. I don't know if you can see them, but there's little paw prints in the concrete. Dalmatian. My Dalmatian. And then the sides, like where the stairs are, are little fire hydrants because they're like, you know, they're firefighter dogs. I guess all dogs use fire hydrants, but you know, let's just pretend that's what it's for. And then the sides of this building have little bones. Then you got Cruella. Don't know what she thinks she's going to achieve, but not much of anything because these dogs are too smart. And this is our room. They are definitely renovated. That's for certain from what they used to look like. I wish they would have stuck with, you know, um, classic faces, but it's all right. I mean, it's all right. It's almost pretty much just like Pop Century was. I mean, yeah, not much different. Well, I guess the bathroom is kind of different because like the vanity here is a little bit different. Not as many pillows, but the same concept with pulling the bed down. And you have to have Walt Disney World today on, that's for sure. And then it's just like this little shelf area with a fridge. Right now, my camera battery is dying. I had two with me, but I went swimming and um, brought it in with me. So we're gonna charge up for a little bit. I am ready to take you guys on a magical journey. This is Gracie's bandana from Valentine's Day. The one thing that I don't really love about this room, which is not much because I, I, it's cute, it's clean, it's simple, it's perfect for the money, this room is totally worth it. Was it before? No, they were pretty bad with the carpets and all that. But this curtain is just, I don't understand it. I don't know where it came from. I don't even know who put it in here. I, I didn't sign up for that. It could have just been solid like white or maybe not white, like a solid like Maybe like a solid blue, like that like could match like Donald's hat or something. Or ye yellow's too obnoxious. Maybe it could have been black. Even black. Black's my favorite color. But something just doesn't seem right here. Do I look okay enough to go to dinner somewhere? Because we have dining reservations. We do have to drive there. Can you tell I took a nap? My friends tell me, yeah, you can and you look awful, but... 
Well, I just noticed a really sweet detail here for everybody. It's like all-star sports and movies together. So like, they have the movie reel, baseballs, basketballs, balls, all kinds of stuff going on here. Okay, so now we're gonna head to dinner, go eat, and then we'll come back and we'll like walk around the grounds. All right, to get to um, Sanaa though, the only problem that I have with Sanaa and eating here is the parking garage is a little confusing and I I don't know like, am I supposed to park at this spot or over here? And I mean, it's not that big of a deal. I mean, piddle paddle. <laughs> the bigger deal is the bugs on my windshield that are stuck there. I don't even know if Jumbo House is open yet. I don't think so, but I don't know. All right, see like here we enter the parking garage. Bum bum. Oops. Bum bum bum. I'm not sure if Timon is closest to the restaurant. It's not even that busy in here. So I should probably just take that spot that I found. Back up, Veronica. Back it up. I don't have a backup camera. So I have a really hard time seeing out of this car because like the convertible top. Oh, don't hit it. Don't hit the bull. Excellent. So we just have to remember we are in Timon. I can't believe we made it on time. I didn't think we would. You know, what would be really awesome is if we got a table by the window with the animals. I doubt that's gonna happen because I'm just a party of one, so they're probably like, eh, she's just a party of one. But I'm a party of one that loves animals. Like, I'm so obsessed with animals. You park in the garage, then you go across the hallway, then you go in an elevator that takes you First down to Sonoma. And as soon as you come out of the elevator, it's literally right here. It is really, really pretty in here. And I hope I can see some of the little animals out there. Oh wait, our table is already ready. So, I, um, I have like the world's biggest table for someone who's single. And <laughs> I look hilarious. I think it looks really funny, but I'm going front and center. Now most people come here for the click, the bread service, and yeah, that's me. I am definitely getting the bread service, and I get the same drink every time I get a, um, yep, um, I get the mango lassi smoothie, where is it, oh, right there, so good, and then I get... The burger. Wow, this is going to be one expensive meal here, huh? Okay, this is the mango lassi smoothie. It's mango and lassi all mixed together. And it is so good and I try not to drink it too fast because I usually get super full and I usually drink it way too fast. I'm so worried I'm gonna drink that fast. It is so good. It's the best smoothie I've ever had in my life. Now, if you've never seen this before, which you probably have, this is the Sana Bread Service. And it's amazing. I usually typically like go for the hummus and the mango one. So good, yes. Yeah, it looks really good. Thank you. That's my friend. Now, you guys know that I am not even like an adventurous eater. So for me to say this is really good means something. And there's different types of the naan bread. Some are like plain, there's cheese, garlic, there's all in I'm never gonna be able to finish all this food, but I can take it home with me, back to the room. Okay, here's our current situation. Tap out of the bread service. A little nervous, well I, drank, I ate most of the hummus and the mango one. I didn't even know I like mangoes, but apparently I do, it's not. Now, we're gonna chill out with this. We don't need any more for now. But good, good. Okay, this is the burger. It comes with chips that I really don't like at all. And I already took a bite out of it. But it is really, really good. I don't get it with goat cheese. And I got it well done. But it is perfect. I'm actually super duper full and I'm afraid I'm not gonna be able to finish any of this. Okay, this should never be a thing. Um, one person should not um, conjure up a $45 bill. I'm gonna sneeze. As much as you guys hear me complain about meals at Disney, I will not complain about some, I mean, if I had a bad meal, it's not all I would, but I have never 
and I love it and I keep coming back. So there you go. And my server, his name was Simo and he was so good. He was like super sweet and he was like over the table a lot and yeah, it went well. I just watched a family walk in from this door and thought that this was some new outdoor path that I never saw with animals or something. Yeah, it's not. Okay, nope. First floor. I am extremely full from dinner. And I like this little like golf cart turnaround we got outside of our door. So now we're gonna walk around, try to walk off some of that uh, carb load that we do every day to ourselves and say we're not going to do it the next day, but we continue the pattern and wonder why we're gaining weight. It's no question. I think what we're gonna do is start from furthest away. This is my least favorite section of all. I don't even think I've ever watched this movie. I have no interest in sports whatsoever. I was a cheerleader growing up and I did dance I did t-ball as a toddler, and that was the extent of my sport life. Believe it or not, I also ran track. <laughs> my mom can tell you what happened there. Okay, the good news is, is that the pool is completely empty right now. There is literally not a soul in this pool. So if we wanna go swimming, the lifeguards are just sitting with their feet in the water. Okay, no, that's a guess. <laughs> I shouldn't say that. Disney don't listen to that. Not that you're watching, but don't listen. What a nice booty pose there. So Goofy over here, he looks like he's twerking with the, um, the, the, the thing. Oh my gosh, hockey stick. You're not that dumb. And then the locker rooms are the bathrooms and laundry room. Not quite sure what this is. I think it's just, um, like an area for them. I think if we go swimming tonight though, I'm gonna learn to be a Mighty Ducks fan because this will be the pool that we're going to go in. We could pool hop, but I get so cold easy. And then I get so hot easy. I'm not a super um, spoiled person. I mean, I kind of am, but if I was put in this section, I think I would abort mission. <laughs> I'd rather stay at all-star sports. This, 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 no, doesn't work for me. I hear a critter in the bush. Why have I not learned my lesson? I have been bit by wild animals so many times without provoking it. I don't know why I'm doing that. But look at the doggy canine crunchy bone pathway. This is so cute. And you know what, if you like Mighty Ducks, that is not anything against you. It's just what, oh my gosh, how cute. You guys may hate Dalmatians. No, no problem with me. You don't like Dalmatians, it's not your thing. You do you, not worried about it. Dalmatians are a symbol of unity and beauty and love. Oh my gosh, if I can get on my photo bucket, which they keep sending me emails saying that they're erasing my account because I'm a little whatever they're saying to me. I don't ever listen. They're gonna delete my photos, which would really be sad, but look at how beautiful with the sky behind Perdita, how stinking cute. I guess that would be like a way to describe me. I'm super passionate about the things I love and I'm super bluntly honest about the things I don't love. So it's either like one end of the spectrum or the other. There's no like in between. Like if I don't like you, I don't like you. I did a counter the other day with my friend of how many people I don't like. There's only four people on that list. So just because I'm, you know, I can see why this is the preferred section because right there is like the lobby area. So we're really, really, really close to that from here. And this is the main pool, which is, I think, in my opinion, a lot cooler than the hippy dippy pool because you got Mickey. Maybe it's because Mickey's like just the best. So if I see Mickey, I'm automatically like, yes. The sky is so gorgeous. It looks like a sheet cake from like Costco or something. And right here is like what would be like the petals bar. It's called hey. Silver Screen Spirits, which you can get like sangria, beer, wine, rocks, frozen. You can get liquor, alcohol, you know, beverages. I cannot get over how beautiful that sky is. Dang, what a good night to be alive. I am so thankful to still be here. That would look pretty. In a frame, in a bathroom. 
So when you pull this bed down here, this is the lovely artwork, which I, again, wish they would have just made them original characters. Not sure why they're like, their band is cholesterol. Probably stands for their names. But I'm gonna pretend it's cholesterol. And I, I slept here from like midnight to three, and then I moved over here from three to like six. Okay, so fast forward. It's morning now, I'm showered. I'm wearing this fake swimmy outfit that I made up myself. Cause we're gonna go have breakfast and then we're going to the pool. I, I really do not like checkout day. It's like depressing, you know, it's like, I made a home here for the night and it's time for me to say goodbye to my, my home, you know? No, not at all. But also I hate going and walking around or not walking around, but like going home with dirty clothes. So first thing we're going to do is put our clothes in the washer, then we'll click we're here, even though yesterday it automatically said I was there when I wasn't, but let's just look at the laundry rooms. Just perfect. This is the cutest soda machine I've ever seen in my life. That is so cute. And this is the beautiful laundry room. $3 to wash four pieces of clothes. And the first time I did laundry in Disney, it took quite some time for three of us adults to figure out how to do this. But you come here to the thing on the wall, you remember the name, I mean not the name, the number of your washer, and that's how it goes. I don't know what this part really has to do with anything, but you know, you got these guys that were annoying Mickey. This was for Mickey spraying his water tentacles. The hat, gotta have the hat. It's actually kind of cute. I wonder what's in it. Oh, you can't go in it. Yeah, you can go in it. Let's see. Oh, it's like a cave of wonder. Oh my goodness. I will never understand all star resort haters. This is so cool. Come on, if you had kids, this is so cool. And then you've got the soldiers. You got Donald and Daisy, which don't have anything to do with it but glad they stuck them in here. Am I confused? This kind of reminds me of like the Nutcracker, which to me, I don't, I don't really know what that has to do with Fantasia. Maybe I need to rewatch or something. And the coolest food court at Walt Disney World. When I think about food courts, this isn't what comes to mind, but look at how awesome All-Star Movies food court is. I mean, usually they don't have like that thing in the middle, but. Okay, I found a perfect little corner. I don't know what we have ordered here, but we're gonna see. So it's confirmed the kids one comes with two Mickey waffles. Don't they look good? It's our lucky day. Finding Nemo's on. I love Finding Nemo. We turned our second waffle into a waffle surprise. So this is the love bug section, which you can see the love. And look, the love bug. That'd be a cool wall to get a picture in front of. I do not consider my car to be a love bug. I call it a doom buggy. It's kind of like racing themed, which I've never even seen this movie before, but somebody down here in Orlando literally made their beetle look like this. He's looking right at you. And there's his rear end. So, um, well, this isn't my favorite section. Fantasia looks like it could use a little bit of paint. Looks a little faded. Also not my favorite section. As I was saying, the Fantasia section needs a little bit of TLC. That rose is, I don't know what's going on with it, but it's not right. Just wait until you see this next section. It is so cute the Toy Story section. So they got like the little army men up here coming out of their bucket, you see? Like they're coming out of their like bucket. And then you got RC car, he's been here for so long. And then this door is gigantic and it says Andy's room. And look, it's like we're in Andy's like play area. You got like a giant buzz and this guy's shooting at him or something. Bo, Woody, I did not like Bo in the new movie at all. Didn't like that character. That has nothing to do with anything. Checkers with little Mickeys. Then there's Rex, blocks, and a window. 
And inside of here, last night they were showing movie. So, oh, okay, they have it up here written like where, I mean, not where, what's gonna be playing. Today is Tuesday, so. And then down here, there's a playground and somebody's playing at it, so we're not gonna film that. I don't know why they're always putting age limits on this stuff. And then in here is like a little kid splash pad play area thing. We're not gonna do, uh, we're not gonna film that. It's just like a, a foot deep pool for kids. Oh dear, that's a little trashy. Eh. Looks like she's coming in the bucket. I mean coming out of the bucket. I am totally going in this. And this, I still can't get over. Like I am still smiling about it. It makes me so like filled with joy. <laughs> You know what I think is funny? Is that there's like a magic band tap to get into the laundry room. And I'm like, I don't believe that there is anybody on this earth that lives in Orlando that's like, hey, you know where I want to do my laundry for $3 a load? I want to go to all-star movies and music and sports. And I want to do my wash there. I want to go through the security, convince them that I'm staying here or know somebody. And that's, that's how I want to do my laundry. So if sensor stuff is still in the wash and it has 60 minutes, we might as well hang out by the duck pool. Okay, we're going to creep a little bit further in, like butts going on the water spot. Update, it is, it is as cold as the other day. It is freezing. Am I stupid for like creeping in at my actual height? So like if I go in, like I have to doggy paddle around. It is, it is, it is, it is really, really nice. Look at how pretty the water is. Like it's like, it looks so pretty. Okay. It's definitely not going to be as easy to film by this pool because there's a lot more people over here. So that's not going to work. I picked like the furthest away corner so I can be away from people. And um, I don't know that I'm actually going to get the courage to do this right now. It takes a lot for me to go in the pool. So I don't know if I can muster up the courage in this one. It's, it's a little intense. Goodbye, Dalmatians. I had a very fun time with you. Gracie, this song's for you. 